here I am in my bathroom attempting to do something for my husband I've never done before. No, not that. Um, I'm going to try and clean the shower drain. I'm terrified. I watched him do this a million times and it's disgusting. Uh, the mere thought of thinking about it makes me dry heave and I want to puke everywhere. Um, will I be successful? Most than likely. Will I end up not puking? I can't guarantee it. Uh, all I'm going to do is try and get this on video and show you ladies how to do it yourself because I think the time has come where you really don't need to depend on your man to do everything for you. I mean, I do a lot of stuff for myself, so yeah. And I mean, to be honest, um, it is my hair, mostly. Um, he has short hair and he has threatened to shave me bald. Um, I think that really says to how much he hates cleaning the shower drain. Um, that said, I'm going to need a few things and I'm going to kind of MacGyver this myself like I do many other things. Um, and I'll just record how I do things and hopefully that helps you out. Um, stay tuned. I have gone and found this really old flat head screwdriver and I don't think my husband will miss it if I destroy it or do something to it I wasn't supposed to. I'm pretty sure that if we poke this and I'm already um, dry heaving here just thinking about what's hiding down here. I believe some of these shower heads come with screws in the middle, maybe on the side somewhere where you have to screw it. This one looks like it's just gonna pop off. And as I thought, it is disgusting. Um, I think I'm gonna clean this as well separately. Uh, but there it is, that's the first part. Let's get that off and try and dig out as much of the clog as we can. Gross. Next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to drop this nasty looking shower cover in the sink. Going to use good old fashioned baking soda. Dump that all over. I don't think there's a recipe to it. Just uh, make it snow. All right. If you like science, I guess that's uh, that's what happens. You start mixing and doing things. I got some pure white vinegar here, and I'm just going to make it go foamy. And I think I'm gonna leave it in here for a little bit of time. Oh, that's wonderful. It smells disgusting, but let's just leave that in there and let it do its thing. So I'll uh, show you what it looks like after need a cleaning cloth and give this guy a wipe and a rinse. I do wish I had someone else to do the camera for me to show you actually how easy it is to clean it. But that's it. You leave it in the solution. You come back to it a few minutes later and give it a good wipe and a rinse. It almost looks like new. Do the same thing I did with the other guy. Maybe cover. Just gonna dump a bunch of this stuff in there. Once again, I'm not following any recipes. I'm just kinda hoping for the best here. I'm going to get my pure white vinegar ready. And there we go. Sounds great. Yeah. Very good. So there's that. I'm gonna wait a bit and the next step for me is going to be to boil some hot water. So stay tuned. So far is to take my cleaning cloth and I went in with the cleaning cloth and this old nasty screwdriver. I went around the sides, cleaned all this up and what I'm going to do now is pour down boiling hot water and just make sure I get all of that because heaven knows the buildup of the conditioner particularly is probably the worst thing for your drain from my understanding anyways so yeah, just a lot of water rinse everything down and uh, let's see what happens let's hope I haven't messed anything up here Boiling water is best. 
and that looks pretty good. Quick wipe. So far, so good. Okay, grab my little cover, snap it back into place. And it sounds like it's in. Excellent. Okay, and we're just gonna test it and make sure it's draining. Oh, that looks beautiful. Okay, you know what? Wasn't as hard as I thought it was going to be. Very nice. There you have it ladies, it's not that bad. I survived and I am very happy with how it turned out. And the best part is, I don't think you actually have to do it that often. Um, I suppose when you see that your drain is going nice and slow and it's not, uh, it's not doing the best of jobs, maybe once a month or something like that, you should be okay. Um, yeah, it was really good.